So it's unique on the 21 CRF is that they've changed to an oval manifold. And that's the, the most critical area for that exhaust flow. The hot gases coming right out of the exhaust port. The way you manage that transition is extremely critical. We're not going from big circle to small circle. We're not going from big oval to small oval. We're going in between two different geometries. It's something simple as drive down the freeway at 50 miles an hour, put your hand out the window and just move a finger any little movement and you can feel dramatic changes in pressure, dramatic changes in force. Honda spent a lot of time in R&D and making sure that that exhaust port flows the most amount. And so we wanted to make sure that we're not, we're not choking that off by trying to adapt something that we've already done. We need to harness that extra power that Honda went into the development work on and make sure that we're, we're improving on that with, throughout the rest of the system. And it all starts at that Hydroform primary. So with hydroforming, you're able to get away from having the, the constraints of just a regular tube bend die. And you can now design in CAD the shape that you want to go from the oval to the round. And that gives you that perfect transition from round to oval that you couldn't accomplish by standard tube bending. Hydroforming is the most organic fluid transition that minimizes, maybe even eliminates any disruptions that you would see from the other processes. So we were able to work with Honda for almost a year, very closely, to fine tune this exhaust system, both in performance, in fit, in packaging, in quality, so that what the end user is getting is the best exhaust system that you can get for the 2021 CRF 450R.